I am honored to come here for the inauguration ceremony of this new palliative care center. The palliative care center Ulkhanam Jian in a village of the Lip, Nilala, Nalia, Adrebini, Pratega Moyet, and Nibaria. And I'd like to thank Nafisa and Abdul Aziz Ji for donating the land for this building. This is going to help many, many patients deal with cancer and live a comfortable life. I think it's very important that everybody, regardless of who they are, are given dignity, respect, love and affection. And it quite it pleases me to see the level of community participation in Kerala when it comes to healthcare and education. And of course, Kerala is a pioneer in palliative care in the whole country and leads the way as far as health care is concerned and palliative care is concerned. So I hope this center will be a small step in taking forward the community health care vision of the state. And here the Pain and Palliative Care Association started in 2016 and has doctors, nurses, Drivers and cooks. Diwali leh paliat care center. Jandaer je padinaare leh arah macam mana? Awak tu mario, nurse mario, orang kau mula sembilan tu lu buat itu naya. Ipo nada kau tu lu kena lagi itu. I'm happy that my colleague Anil Kumarji has donated a a vehicle. Ini ke senosha unda, nama kita MLA Anil Kumar ibu datuk guru bandi wagenam. And I'd also like to thank the youngsters who raised money for the other vehicle and also the local family that has given us the third vehicle. I'm always ready to help in any way possible, of course. The funds we get are limited, so we have to we have to distribute them carefully. But I am very honoured and proud to have helped you with this building. Namada MB fund and orang orang kerja peribadi maya tu gamat reyo lo. Orang orang selekti itu je urikan betul lo. Pasal ingiri meni ke san dosa unde. Macam ni dili ini kaya tuil talpe. Orang orang sahaja ikan kerjanya orang orang dale. Ini kerja san dosa un jari dar tu unda. And of course today in the speech, in the speech I gave just before this, I said that. I now feel that Vayanad is like my second home and I feel like I'm coming back to my family here. So it's a, I'm quite happy because I don't think many people uh, get the opportunity to enjoy their work as if they are, you know, going back home and working with their family. And of course, as a member of parliament, you meet many, many people, many tragedies, you know, are seen by you. Uh, you see a lot of pain of, 
of your constituents. Orang Barat ini memerlukan ini. Pelajar yang kandung itu membawa pelajar apa kerana kalau membaca beri pelajar beri orang kalau membaca beri kerana 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 feelings that anybody can have is when a relative of theirs or a friend of theirs has cancer. And it is almost like a slow death sentence. But you also get to see the best character of people when they they have a relative or a friend who has cancer. Nengka abadai kanan kiri mana allah subahu guna ulah anak gelaya, urik abadai abadai da bandar gelaya cancer aku bandar ini peribali kene kanan kiri na wasra unda waru. You can see love, affection, bravery, all these emotions. Nengka abadai kanan batum, nampu kau ulah seni aham, abu api bikiam, okkata na iik terang gatang gelaya ana nampu manusia kan saadi kia. But it is our duty to help our people, especially when they are struggling. Uh, with with diseases like cancer. You know, at the end, I see Vainad and Kerala as one big extended family. And there is that spirit in Kerala also. I can see the spirit of togetherness, spirit of unity in Kerala is very deep. And it's, it's your history also, your culture also. Respect, respect of different religions, different communities, Different ideas. So I'm always learning something new when I come here. So I'd like to thank all of you for that. Now my next plan is to bring my mother here. <laughs> Thank you. Namaskar, I am Ahmed. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe.